So, first of all, I'm gonna go with a um, coin purse or. Um, I'm sorry, I'm just dropping things. I'm sorry. Uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead with small card, like a credit card case, and coin purses. So, this one is my favorite. I bought this in China at the at the Great War Great War uh, souvenir store. I don't know what it says. Uh, I think it's ancient, like a Chinese character. So I don't know what it said. It's full leather, and it's it's sadly a little bit like damaged, but. This is my favorite so far, but I'm saving it because it has a little bit of damage. So I don't want to, I don't want to ruin this any more than that current condition. So this is my favorite so far. I like to when I'm traveling, I like to buy these little bit of you know like pouches because I can't because I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I just said um, because it's really it it's actually useful than just like a souvenir that's sitting in a place not having any purposes so these little things have their purposes and I can use them in my daily uh, life and then I can you know whenever I'm using this I can always uh, like it brings back all the memories to me so uh, another card case this is by Accessorize the brand and I bought this in London so I just um, it's sadly it's, uh, damaged again because all these beads kind of first off first off like it kind of comes off so I am saving this too it's just crazy coin purse and the back is like a satiny uh, fabric so really like that and another card holder that I am currently using is this I bought this in Uganda last year and I was there for a missionary uh, so I didn't have much of uh, free time so I couldn't shop that much I really wanted to shop in their local like market but I couldn't I didn't have any chance so this is what I uh, I bought this at the duty free shop at the airport so it's just basic it doesn't have any tips or I'm oh, sorry it doesn't have any tips or anything it's really it's so cute and it, yeah it's just so cute and adorable I really like this I think it's like so unique what I like about those like this like it's a bit the pouches that I bought from up in abroad is that it's so quite it's so unique and I don't know it's it's so unique and different from the regular manufactured items so next thing these are coin purse I bought this in Thailand it says genuine leather I don't know if it's true or not, but it's it has a snap and it uh, expands a little bit, and inside is just uh, black. So I have red, green, and black. It's been uh, six years almost, or six or five years since I bought these, and I've been using them like a lot and still it shows no wear so i really like those so that's that and let's move on to a wallet so this one this is my favorite wallet i bought this in a thrift store in vancouver and i think i paid only 1.99 or something under two dollars and it's just i think it's leather it's just plain a bill holder, like a paper bill holder. So I love that. It's so vintage looking and it's so slim and light. So whenever I'm just, you know, like going 
shopping or just like going out really packed really light I always bring this so this is my favorite again unique you can find this anywhere else so that's them and this one is by Tori Birch I think this is uh, this is actually a gift from uh, my ex-boyfriend so I don't use this anymore I just you can fit your phone here iPhone 5 so yeah it's really I really like this color I think it's really unique and I don't get tired of that color so but it it's just ex-boyfriend mm, I don't use that anymore and what else this is the current uh, the, the wallet that I'm using currently this is by Kipling and I attach it this like, cute uh, doll <laughs> I bought this in Hungary so yeah it's just plain fabric uh, I don't think it, ha it has a card border so you can put more in it and it has two slots slots for the bills so it's super light and you can wash it hand wash it easily and I just love this <coughs> and last wallet I have is this one actually I bought this for my mom but she doesn't use this like huge ginormous wallet she only use like compact one so this is by full fuller I bought this in a outlet in Germany so it's a huge zip zip around wallet it has so many card slots and bills and uh, this this huge space for your coins so it's a fancy one but it's since it's way too big and heavy I don't use this quite often so those are my wallets and let's go into a pencil pouch I don't know if you guys love stationery as much as I do but I just love stationery like pen and lipsticks <laughs> makes me happy so this is by um, Cats uh, the brand is here Cats Kids Kitson, I think I have like really many pouches from this brand it's vinyl or coated like it's it's coated so it's waterproof and if something gets on the fabric you can just wipe it wipe it away so I really like this the patterns are so cute and in horse turn terms of uh, answers and I love this and another pouch that I love this is by it's a huge and it's packed with all of my pencil pouch so I have all of my uh, color pencils that I use for clubbing this is by Kipling it has it's a signature monkey and I just love the color and the size so it's yeah it's held up really well i bought this in 2010 i think so really like that but those are my big uh, pouches on a daily basis i don't need to carry that big uh that many pencils so what i'm using like daily basis is this one it's leather pouch it's just simple and it's teeny tiny it's super light but it holds the all the pencils that I need on a daily basis and this is by Claire Claire Foam Paint it's Frank's brand I think so I bought this in Germany and the leather smell I know it like it can freak some people out but I really like the smell of leather I'm sorry if you're offended by this but yeah so those are pencil pouches I have like way more than this but I just 
uh, this video and if I show you all of my pencil pouches this video is gonna be forever so let's move on to cosmetic makeup pouches okay this one is my current favorite this is by Hera uh, the Hera collaboration with uh, Hugo and Victor I just love the pattern of this and the color is so unique it's satiny like a satiny fabric and inside is just pink and it holds a ton ton of uh, products and you can wash it i already hand washed this uh, and it's just it turned out fine so i love that this is my current favorite and next thing is this one this one is just a medium size uh, my god there is bug please do not interrupt my video please so, this one i bought uh in daiso daiso is like a korean version or japan japanese version of a uh, dollar tree so not everything is dollar but it starts from like a 50 cent dollar to three five depends on the product so this was only two bucks and it faded a bit because I hand washed it and the color came off a little bit so this is just teeny tiny you know as you can see just ruined a bit but it's just so cute and light and a bit cushiony so I like carrying this I like carrying lipsticks in this pouch and next one is this is it's so special this is a pouch that I bought uh, again in a thrift store in Vancouver so I think I paid only $1.50 so this one held up so nicely and I'm sorry that I have sticks in here inside it says I don't know if it's a brand or what but it's, it says thus and it's Arizona, the Grand Canyon State. Greetings from Arizona. Isn't it so like cute and unique and vintage looking? So this is my favorite. And next I have Levlon pouch. It was a gift with purchase. Inside is red and it's animal like um, pattern fabric. So it's really easy to just remove any stains or things like that so I like this okay next is pretty much oh I have one more uh, pouch from Daiso this was only one dollar but as you can see the color has faded out a little bit because I washed it and it was like way more bright than this, the blue color was so it's a box it's so cheap and useful and uh, I have same thing in a green olive green color so if I don't know if you guys can tell but this is way more bright and deep than this color because it has faded out a little bit but that's okay and next oh I have one more this is I got this from H&M I found this in, in a uh, online H&M more but it was sold out it was just completely sold out in Korea's H&M so I asked for um, someone who's living in London I asked her for buy this and send it to me so I paid like a triple of the original price for that but she was so kind kind enough to actually buy this and uh, send it to me so this is just teeny tiny I have uh, just like a mirror hand mirror earphones and watch and panty liners and this thing of a uh, Bible versus so this watch is actually let me just 
Where is it? This watch is also from the thrift store in Vancouver. I'm sorry, I don't have the name. I think it was uh, like a, a Red Cross or Salvation Army or something like that. So, yeah, this is a watch by Time Max, and it I uh I dropped it once and it just felt the these matters. It has for felt. Like it just broke so I paid about five bucks to fix it get it fixed so it's working fine now so I love this I love this watch so from now on everything is from one brand Cass Kitson so because I love this brand so much because I love floral uh, patterns anything floral and curly and cute this is their, the bigger size, it has enough room, bigger size um, pouches, so I have this one, and this one, some of these are, um, some of these pouches are actually like pre-packed because those are, like some of these pouches I actually use, so for example, I'm using this as my makeup pouch, so I have this one, and this cute red, it has different uh, zips, so I love this, this one, and one more, this, this cute, this is my least favorite because it has so much white on it, and just less flowers so this is my least favorite but still I like it those are my bigger like bigger Lumi pouches and these are my like, uh, slim compact pouches I actually keep my I got phone charger and camera here this one and I have this one and in here I have like a sunscreen for my body and uh, like a deodorant deodorant tissue for sweaty days you just wipe you know those sweats off I use this and Dove spray deodorant and lastly well not last I have one more left this one is my um, like a everyday emergency pouch. I have a spare contact case, just hand sanitizer, those things. So I'm not gonna go through it. I have because I have so many like what's in my bag type of video. So that's that. And lastly, this is actually a uh, like a dessert, dessert camera pouch, I think, because it, it has pads, like a padding in it. So it's for like a dessert items, but I don't, it, yeah, I can't fit my camera in here, but I don't carry my camera that often. So usually I just keep my like lipsticks in here because it's actually perfect size for this, these longer glosses fit perfectly so perfectly so those are so those are all of my got wallets pencil pouches and cosmetic bags so uh i hope you guys like it i'm sorry it's so hot in here <sighs> i'm actually sweating <sighs> i hope you guys can say that but yeah Thank you so much for watching and I will come back with another video soon. Bye!